And welcome back everybody to another M07 Productions. Today I am here with you, not yelling in my microphone. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I feel like I need to do that. Back here with another Trails in the Sky. It's been a week since I've played this, so let's um just hope it's good. So um let's hop on into it. <laughs> don't do me. Did I launch the game wrong? Can I not play it now with my controller? Hold on. Oops. Don't tell me I've launched this game wrong. I won't do control with controller. I have no controller controls. Oh no. I'll be right back. Hold on. No. No. Uh. Uh. How does uh leave? Uh. Exit game. Hold on. I'm not done. It should be just that option. Okay. Don't know what was different, but okay. Let's get into it. All right. So, um, I don't remember what I was doing. Remember, I was at one point. I'm at the north map. I'm at the north area. Of the map. I was looking at the trail over here at one point. That's the landing. So, what was options? Items. Let me go over to books. Racer notebook, yes. All right, there was these were these were here were um two different things. All right, there was find something. Okay. All right, so uh, this one here, parts being made, monsters destroying the Rizzle farms. While we have no injuries as of okay, so I believe I have heading west, south at the fort. I, I was at the wrong road anyway. I'm noticing. Cause, okay, so. Because this one right here says main road. I was at the I was at the mine road. Oh, no, the pine plant has been uh, spotted resolving. Okay. Alright, so let, let's see if I could do something with my orbital real quick. Modify. Yeah, I'll actually hit it right. Stella, can I open up more of yours? I've only opened up one of yours. Not enough. Okay, yeah, I see how much I have now. Okay. Yeah, I, I see I don't have enough. Okay. I have enough for you. Can I make... That requires those still. Mirage, elemental, and space. This is time. Cut one. P arts cost ten percent less. I don't have any um. Time, though, is my problem, so I can't do that. I don't need to do another one of these. I'm just going to keep hoarding them for now. Yes, I said hoarding them. I'm going this way to an area I have not been to yet. Let's see. So the head's south at the, at the thing. I see you down there. I mean, over there. Uh... those I, I'm looking for oh I don't want to get into a fight quite yet. looking for a monster as well what was it called it was called the first is a pine plant which I have not seen yet. so it's gonna be some special monster if I go here yeah I have not seen a pine plant yet. 
probably to the south. That scared me. I did not see them there. Okay, um... Start off with a attack, so why not? Go ahead and just finish this guy. Get rid of him. That's right, kick me. Oh, do it! Oh, you kicked me too. What? Hmm. I will use some tier. No tier is heal. I'm going to just get you for now. Good. Take you out while I was at it. Attack. And this should be it. Right, hit it with that staff. We're good to go. Yay. So. Woo! Got me. I don't like these guys. For that reason. They do a lot of damage. And they're gonna kill him specifically because of this. Art. Uh, speed. I want to destroy you now. I want to use tear on you and heal you right now, because otherwise I'd lose this. I don't know what that icon above is. I don't know what that one's head means, but okay. Oh, that's neat. I can do that. Okay. Pretty sure I knew that and just completely forgot. I know you're not going to do much, but I could stop the other one from attacking before he gets his turn anyway. I will go ahead and hit you, because that will not finish you. Let's do this. Kill this one. He's next in line. This game is still so loud. You. Kill it. Thank you. Okay. Oh, I went to the farm on accident. I didn't want to go to the farm quite yet. That's fine. I come here. I wonder if my mission is also tied to the farm anyway. The other one I'm doing? Let's find out. <sighs> no matter when we come here, this place always is always so tranquil. It's hard to imagine monsters running amok here. I certainly don't sense anything out of the ordinary either. Anyway, let's go ask someone here to fill us in on the details. I wonder if Tio is home already. Sorry, home today. Damn it. I'll learn to read one day. Wow, I really did not expect there to be stuff over here. Chickens? That looks like that's not beetroot. It's a uh, turnip. Chicken, 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 chicken. I can talk to the chicken. It goes the cock. Nothing over here. All right, I'll just. That's fine story. Is there anyone else outside? Okay. Don't know what those are, but okay. They're not pumpkins. I guess I'm going in the house.
beds in this house how many kids do they have I see that I see that bear right there hello so that's the way I came from Down here? Yeah. How does it get there? Okay. Yeah. Camera rotating is quite useful. Hey, find a kill. Hi, Tio. Ah, sorry. The reading's already wearing on me. It's been a while, hasn't it? It's still. Joshua too. Do you guys come did you guys come for a visit? Not exactly. We're here on Bracer Business. We heard that you've been having some trouble with monsters. Stella and Joshua explained that they are here to do their father's work because he is away. You finished all your training. That's wonderful news. Maybe you can help after all. So there really are monsters given you trouble here, huh? Regrettably, that's been the case the past several days now. Thanks to thanks to which I'm suffering from a lack of sleep. Which means the monsters only come out at night. You're very perceptive, Joshua. It'd be better if you if you got all the details from my father though. I imagine he should be back from delivering the milk and vegetables any time now. Okay. Like I'm gonna come over here and he's gonna be here now. No. good situation here. I did not realize he was so low on health. Not good at all. Don't really want to use a revival herb right now, though. Yes. Your bomb. Oh. Yeah. Can I not just be touched? I can use an item. I really want to run. I don't want to fight. Now get away from me. Go inside. Oh, it is go back in. Okay. Good afternoon, Mrs. and Mr. and Mrs. Par Parzell. How is everyone getting on the? How is everyone getting on these days? Okay. I'm not sure if that's a proper translation. Well, if it isn't Estelle and Joshua, what brings you to our neck of the woods? Did you come to CTO? We're actually here just chatting with her outside. Tell you the truth, we're here on 
on an errand today from the Bracer Guild. I'm hoping to get a free rest in this. Is that so? But don't you think this job is a little, a little dangerous for just the two of you to handle? I agree. I'd feel terrible if one of you were to get hurt. Hey, that's probably going to happen, honestly. Don't sweat it. We're bracers after all. And taking care of monsters is right up our alley. The guild, the guild has even authorized us to carry out this task. If you wouldn't mind leaving it to us, we'd be more, more than grateful. Hmm. Well, alright then. Go ahead and have at it. So I had to check the time. Thank you very much, Mr. Par Parzell. <laughs> I'm yawning now. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Could you tell us a little more about the monsters that have been wrecking your fields? I haven't been able to get a clear look at one yet, but it seems to resemble something like a chubby cat. Okay. <laughs> as far as I can tell, three or four appear at night and raid our fields, gnawing on everything they can to get their grubby paws on. Okay. They don't seem threatening exactly, but they're extremely nimble. We've tried many ways to capture them over the course of the last several nights, but no, to no avail. Sounds like a pretty strange bunch of creatures, if you ask me. Since they only appear under the cover of night, we'll have to wait for it to get dark. Then how about taking a load off until then. I assume you'd also be joining us for dinner, right? Sure. Said the magic word. You bet I will. I'm a huge fan of, of your cooking, Mrs. Parzell. I can't wait. You sure know how to please a woman who spends a lot of time tolling in the kitchen. And for that, I'll whip you up something special that'll live up to your expectations. Free dinner? Do I also get a show? <laughs> oh, that was delicious. Mom's cooking is as good as ever, Tio. I'm not sure if that's Tio or just Ty. Either way, Tio sounds like a boy's name. If that's a girl, I'm fairly certain. I could be wrong still. Oh, uh, uh, that's because she gets ex she gets excited to cook whenever we have guests over for for meals. I feel really bad for Joshua though. With the little one jumping all over him like that. Ha ha ha! It's probably a good thing. Surprisingly enough, kids tend to latch onto him a lot. Even if, if anything, I'm more blown away by the fact that the children enjoy playing with such a stick in the mud. I think that's a bit of an over-exaggeration, don't you? It's definitely courageous and maybe even a tad reversed, no, reserved, but if you get to know him, he's really a caring young man. In fact... The fact is, he's not self-conscious about about it. Even about it, too, gives his points in my book. Oh, my watch vibrate it. That is a balloon and a half. I said, "You really think so?" Thinking about it. Uh, which those sticking. Facial features, mysterious amber eyes, and lush black hair. <sighs> <sighs> Hold on. only natural that he'd be a target for all young girls. For all the young girls. Huh? Is Joshua really that popular? 
Are you blind to still? Probably. Rumor has it that more than just a few girls have asked him have asked to go out with him. I hear that he turned them all down though. I had no idea. Joshua never said a word to me about it. I didn't know I don't know how I should even begin to describe his secretive nature after hearing this, but how utterly cruel of him not to confide me in not to confide in me. If you were a boy, I imagine you would be a I imagine it would be a different story. But as a girl, I don't think that's something that's something he would talk to you about. And the, f and the fact that you haven't fallen for him yourself is beyond me. Huh? Why would I? I always feel like I've got someone watching me. I don't like being watched while I read, especially out loud. Estelle, you're in there, aren't you? I, know I say that, and yet I'm doing this on YouTube, and I am quite literally reading to be watched. But I don't like it when people watch me reading kind of deal. I it's like singing. I don't like singing in front of people, but I will absolutely sing in on like on stage and all that. Well, not on stage, but like on mic and all that. Probably would sing on stage, honestly, if it was performance. But it's, it's one of those weird things. When I'm doing this, I don't like when people watch live, like while I'm sitting here doing it. I don't know why. See, phone calls is mainly because they'd be behind me and all that. If it was on a stream, no problem. It's some, just something weird. I wonder. I wonder how many other people and streamers actually suffer with things like that. If uh, if y'all do, let me know. We'll uh, we'll go about it. It's about time to do our rounds. That's what Joshua is saying. Said Joshua. All right, I'm coming. Said Estelle. <laughs> Doing it like a book. I'll be back after after Joshua and I get the job done to you. I'd like to continue this conversation then. Okay. Oh, all right. Be careful out there, Estelle. I should probably save the game. I know I'm also right here at the around the end of the episode mark. That girl, she's either completely out of touch with matters of the heart or just plain dense. Answer is yes. Poor Joshua, he really has his work cut out for him. It seems as though the monsters always show up about this time. We'd better, we'd better get outside and take a look around. Er, what's going on, Estelle? I've got to ask Joshua. You don't happen to have any secrets you're not telling me about, do you? Come on now. Where are you coming up with this stuff? Since you came to live with us, you've always done everything together, right? Even though we've had our fair share of, of fights. They're all good memories for me now, and what I mean to say, I've come to think you as family in every sense of, of the word. So if there's anything on your mind that you'd like to talk about, I'm available to lend my ears. To lend an ear. Gosh darn it. Same thing, just one of them's one ear. Maybe. You know about, you know about things like trouble with your love life and whatnot? What are you trying to say? Nothing, I just wanted to let you know that I'm here to listen if you need someone to talk to, that's all. Let's hurry up and get out there so we can kick some monster butt. What kind of nonsense is Tio putting into that girl's head? Secrets, huh? Alright, I'm going to go ahead and cut it here. We're at uh, 24 minutes. I just don't want it to run too long. We're going to pick right back up here next week. Same day. I believe these are going public on Thursdays right now. Um, of course, that's subject to, subject to change by the time that this is recorded. Because I've already got everything else already scheduled out. And I'm nowhere near where the scheduling ends right now in real time. So, um, for all I know, this may be on a different day. This, if this is on like a Monday... Next one probably be on a Monday. Unless it's right there at the time where I have to change the schedule, scheduling because of streams and all that. But I I'm trying to make it to where I'm working around when Alex streams kind of deal. So that he streams on days I don't have a video going public. So we're not overwhelming everybody. And we're keeping content rolling at a consistent rate, but not too packed into one day. I know some days I do multiple videos a day, and that's normally because of a big event or... 
I've got it so far backlogged I have to get rid of it kind of deal because of other things that are coming up that we want to get pushed farther or sooner actually. But um, as it is right now I've moved on to the um, I'm calling it the 2-3 format where we've got three streams, two uploads right, or not two uploads, two um, publications in, um, in a week kind of deal. And then of course if he changes to two streams a week or goes back to one stream a week or whatever he does I might still keep with two uploads in a week. Might. Just depends on how fast things are going and how many series I've got rolling at a time. Like right now I've actually got two things rolling. So I'm doing two different uploads a week. One's for Civ, as y'all have probably seen and may have even finished by now. And one is for this. But until then, we will see you in the next episode. This is Metal Dublin 7 saying, I will see y'all in the next video.